just let the tractor warm up before we go down and feed out our two bales of silage and one bale of hay. We have got passengers today. Bye bye. And arrow. Awesome. Alright. Let's go load up. Alright, we got two bales on the front. We got one silage and one hay. And one silage on the back. Alright. Well, we better go feed these girls. We go today. Yep. So I finished feeding out for the cows. They were happy enough to get their three bales. Now, might as well feed out for tonight. There's a bale already in there. That's the hay bale. As you can see here, this is the what happens to farm uh, when we get too many droughts in a row. A lot of weeds, a lot of weeds. This paddock's going to be cropped in the coming year. Just feeding out. Getting a bit bumpy in this pit. Oh. Okay, so I lost my bale. I finished feeding now. I had to go pick it up. <laughs> that happens. That happens. So yeah, drought on drought on drought has made this paddock extremely bumpy and full of weeds. So this paddock will be popular next year. We'll hopefully, we're going to get some grass back soon. Let's see how we go. Alright, well, let's go load up again, put some more silage on for tomorrow morning, and then I'm going to get to doing some rolling. Alright. There he goes, there goes the contractor. Kind of going under side of the paddock. Get ready to hop out of the tractor. Two nuisances in the tractor. Alright, we're all loaded up for tomorrow morning just need one bale of hay and time to get the roller on this girl and go do some rolling first i think i'll get the grease cartridge and replace it how-to video on how not to get grumpy at um, inanimate objects. Yeah. Oh well, then do it. Those days everything just seems to go a little bit wrong. That's one of those days. So. It'll get better. It'll get better. There. No, right. we'll go down, put on the roller now, and we'll go roll those paddocks Dougie is currently under sewing, or the contract is currently under sewing. Okay, let's hope we can't muck just today. There's a couple of uh, words I'm probably going to edit out in this video that you've probably heard already, but you don't want to hear it. I'll probably just mute it rather than so don't have to hear it. Okay, awesome. Ah, not too bad, not too bad. Right, we'll give her a quick breeze up now. Let's go do some rolling. The reason why I've got the three ton roller on today is because when the contractor goes through, he's actually got a um, undersole that drops good, it drops the seed underneath the soil, underneath the top layer of the soil, but also cuts open and can make the paddock a bit bumpy. And what we've got to do is we're going to try and close up those ridges with the roller. So we're going to do that today. Get a bit bumpy in spots, but that's all right. And um, we don't want to be going too fast because with a big roll like this, it's just all concrete. And as you're aware, if you go too fast, concrete just bounces and you break it. So we'll try and keep it about 10, 10 going down the race. You can see nice and slow, and 10 going through the paddock. That's our top speed. So we use this roller so it doesn't. Uh, we need more weight for this one rather than going through these paddocks, which. Contractor undersoed recently, uh, not undersoed, power arid. We don't need the compaction, we need the just to take off the ridges and level out the paddock a bit better and to cover the seed over the soil. So, this fella, all he's about is leveling ground and just, just compacting it down so that we don't, don't have any bumps through the paddock. Alright, we're going to go in our first one now. We already greased them up, so we'll go in there now. We're in, we're away. Dirt sticking up everywhere. Oh, that's the aim of this roller. 
he's gonna level that out. So we're gonna have big clumps, we're just have a nice flat paddock. Alright, oh, I think we've got top speed 8, sounds good. Just tick along like that. We'll be happy as, eh, Aaron? There you go, we've done the first couple of rounds now, that's before on that side, and that's after. So you can see most of the lumps are all rolled through. All these bloody little, little bits of soil everywhere. And roll them to the ground again. Rips it up a little bit, all for the good of the farm. Put in a nice grass here that should last three what, three years, hopefully. And eventually this paddock will be cropped, much like that one was. And that still hasn't popped its head through yet, but that's all right. It's still got another bit before it actually does, and hopefully some more rain. So we just keep going around the outside and keep rolling. All right, all right. let's finish rolling the worst of them. The contract is still going over there. Doing a good job. Yeah, well, I'll shoot over there and start rolling those ones. Might go for lunch first. I'll go for lunch first. And then come down, continue rolling behind them. Might even bring them some grass seed. Awesome. Alright. So back to rolling. Arrow's ready in the tractor. All greased up, now we'll head out to the big paddock off the top and into the spot. Yeah, the roll is going well, we're stopping every new paddock and giving her a grease up. I uh, went into the swamp, did about half of it. I thought I'd better come out here because the contract, he's not far away from being in the paddock where the cows are actually grazing at the moment. So we're going to pull them out of there and put them into uh, the night paddock. And then here yeah, the contract will go into that paddock. So what time is it now? About 20 to 3, so we're going well, we're going well. Rolling is doing a good job in a way. Help promote the grass soon. Okay, awesome. Carry, yeah. carry on. Just let the girls go. They're on their way. Got the roller on. Contractor's just finished that paddock. Happy ears. Yep, so. Cows are on their way. And he'll go on this paddock while we roll the other paddock. Go Jamie. Go Jamie. Farmers and the cows, eh? He's doing well, he's doing well. There's one problem. He's in my way. I'm out of seat. Get it out of the paddock. <laughs> yes, yeah, so he's out of seed. The boss has come with some more. He's on the way. He's just pulling in the gateway. He's got one problem though. He's got to wait for the cows. Oh, that's good. He'll lock them away. Just into their paddock, as you see there. Going for the silage and the hay. All good. Well, we'll keep rolling. Time to roll this one. The boss and the contractor discussing the plan of attack. It's going well. Going well. I'm just in the paddock here. Going, we're going good. But, uh... He said he's so far done nearly about 18 hectares with that one included. It'll be 18 hectares of the farm for us, under sown. So we'll carry on. We've done, I think I've rolled about 10 hectares so far today. So going good, going good. Yeah. He's waiting for the boss. The boss is coming down in his ute. He's run out of grass seed. So, he'll get well, he's coming down there. He's got that little patch to go, and we've got this much to go. So. We still won't catch him. We still won't catch him. Wow! Oh, I thought I'd drop something. Here's my grease gun. Yeah, there we go. That one rolled, and that one there rolled. Oh, it's doing a great job. All right, we'll go down and take her off, and I think we'll call that a day. So, like and subscribe, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Thank you.